Miami-Dade County is stepping up school bus safety with the help of some high-tech cameras. The night team's Jessica Vallejo is live in Miami Shores to explain. Jessica. This is a combination of education and enforcement. Now, Miami-Dade County Public Schools tells us with the addition of cameras on these school buses, they hope this will track down anyone who breaks the law. It's no surprise these days cameras are everywhere and have become a crucial factor in catching people who break the law. And this is about to take place and if you violate, unfortunately, you will receive a $200 fine. Miami-Dade schools announced on Tuesday the start of a program that allows school buses to have cameras in the stop arm to ticket drivers that illegally pass buses to flash their technology forward and gain a camera advantage. The company they partnered with, Bus Patrol, posted this video. Stop arm deployed. Stop arm. Camera activated. The camera sensor detects movement on the left side of the bus. Violation recorded. And captures the license plate of anyone who breaks the law. Miami-Dade County Schools partnered with Bus Patrol to launch the school bus safety program with Miami-Dade Police. All school buses in the district are now equipped with this safety technology and it's being rolled out in two phases, a 30 day warning period that began on Monday, where if you pass a school bus while the red lights are on, the stop sign is out and it's completely stopped, it will read your license plate and send you a warning. Real enforcement in the form of a $200 ticket, the school district hopes to begin on May 8th. This will unfortunately trigger some conversation and unfortunately for those that violate or could feel like they do not need to abide by the law will unfortunately pay a financial fine. Luis Diaz, the chief operating officer of Miami-Dade County Public Schools, speaking with 7 News about what kind of step this truly is for our kids' security. This would be something that everyone should be doing every day that's transporting in a car. But it doesn't come without legislative hurdles. Senate Bill 766 was signed by Governor Ron DeSantis in May of 2023. It allows for the identification of school bus driving related infractions. Since the legislature passed the bill, updates to the bill have been made that revolve around what to do with the money from the bill. So at any given moment, an update to the bill could be made. And the community will know what is expected on May 8th. So that is our goal and, and that's basically our target. That's game day for us. And again, May 8th is the expected starting date for these real live ticketings. I'm live in Miami Shores, Jessica Vallejo, 7 News, 19.